name is Randall Restley. I'm the Vice President of Applications Engineering here at DigiKey. DigiKey strives to bring you the latest technologies and the latest suppliers we can find to enable you to make your products as modern as they can be. Today there's a whole lot of talk with IoT, a lot of activity around RF, so I've brought some RF products. What's very hot right now is Bluetooth connected devices. And uh, version 5 of the standard has been out for a while. And what version 5 does is it increases the data rate twice as fast over Bluetooth version 4.2. Um, but it also has a longer range. Now, it turns out you don't get double the speed and the longer range for free. It turns out the farther away you get, the coding of the signal changes so that the data rate reduces. But that's fine for most IoT devices. At a long range, you typically don't have a whole lot of data coming back. So it's a very flexible RF standard. And I happened to bring a, uh, a sample of a product from Dialog. Now Dialog is well known for its very low power products. And um, I happen to have one of their development kits that allows you to experiment and play around with a Bluetooth low energy connected uh, solution. And so uh, this can be a very fast way to get up to speed to develop and play around with that increased range or higher speed rate. So this plugs on in and uh, now you've got a development kit. Put your battery in there, your battery operated and with this low power that should last a long time. Now the other product I have is uh, an antenna. Now there are a lot of antenna solutions out there, but typically an antenna has a problem if there's nearby metal. Uh, it turns out with this antenna product from um, Johansson, this is a 2.4 gigahertz um, antenna, this antenna happens to require a uh, metal plane. Now I was looking at the data sheet and I could not find whether that has to be ground connected or floating. So that, that's an open-ended question. But the point is this antenna requires a metal surface. And uh, that's quite appropriate if you've got such a small space that your battery, uh, you've got a battery holder, those things are typically metal, uh, that could be the metal surface. Um, if you've got a circuit board, you don't want to take more space to isolate to get the antenna, you can put it on there. So this is a great little solution for uh, very small uh, products. Thank you for listening.